-hmm. Arms reversed push-ups, we'll be working our chest, especially the upper chest. We'll hit a little bit of our shoulders too and our triceps, of course. So beginner variation, get an inclined surface, just like you do normal push-ups. Beginner is always at the inclined surface, raised surface, get on your toes, tiptoe as, as hard as you can, such that your calves are tight. Keep those glutes tight, tucking those abs, chest nice out, nice and proud, and that would be a normal push-up. But arms reversed, we are switching our arms like that. And by doing so, we'll be targeting a little bit more of the upper chest. So still, but same principles, tiptoe as hard as possible, and go down. Control the down, push up. Control the down, push up. Of course, the higher the surface, the easier it will be. If you find that's a bit easy, you can do maybe 10 reps without, um, without really tasking yourself. You can start to make it harder by taking the level lower. So, you could also get on your knees. Again, just like you do push-ups on knees, don't stick out your, your glutes at the back. Keep them nice, nice and tight. That would be a normal push-up on knees, but just reverse the arms, just like before. If you find that your wrists are feeling a little bit un uncomfortable, you can warm them up before you start, like gently. So this should be gentle. Don't put all your weight on your wrist in this position. Just do it gently. Just begin tasking your weight on it. You can try the, you can try the different directions. You can do one at a time. Eh? Don't, don't do both at a time because then you put all your pressure on the wrist. And this is a, a delicate position. So you can do it in all directions. Lean forward. And of course, you can do this on an inclined surface also. Lean backwards like that. You know, you can try and move in circles. You can warm them up. But if you feel like your wrists are still disturbing you, then just do no, no more push-ups. No harm. No more push-ups just like that. But we want to do the arms reversed if you're okay, if your body can handle it. Yeah. Keep on knees. And just like before, if this is getting easy, you can begin doing negatives first of all. Just like any other push-up. You can do negatives. So the negative of the motion would be as you go down. So what, what you do is just get into position like this. And then squeeze as slow as possible as all the way down. When you get down, get up whichever way you want. You can switch your, the, the position of your wrists. Get up. Position yourself again. And then squeeze. Keep those glutes tight. Then come up whichever, you, which, whichever way you want. Next, pos next progression, get on your knees and just wrap them out. Now this time without negatives. And if that's getting easy, still... Get on all fours. And wrap them out. Of course, before that progression, you can still do negatives if um, you haven't yet built enough strength to do them on all fours. And still like the one on the negatives on knees, you'd get on all fours, squeeze your core, tighten your core, get down. Then get up whichever way you want. Get up, position again. Squeeze, like that. All right.